a large hill of boulders near Gila Bend. You can drive by it all day without thinking twice. But wait, what's that? Two men in camouflage have taken this high ground, holding it, watching. Basically what I'm using here is a high-powered spotting scope. It's just a range finder. They're an elite group of Maricopa County Sheriff's deputies. Soldiers, if you will, in a war with drug cartels, trying to stem a never-ending invasion of cartel members and the drugs they carry. They won't reveal their identities here because they know the cartels are always watching. And they've never allowed a television crew on a stakeout with them until now. We have a main wash out in front of me and I'm basically looking down as far as I can down that wash, see if I can see any movement, uh, whether it be people or vehicles. Rock over there. These small spotter teams will watch for the smugglers from their hidden positions. Sometimes they're on foot, sometimes ATVs. Further on that vehicle. And then radio to crews on the ground to intercept them. That's your copy. And the bus can be big, hundreds of pounds of pot at a time, sometimes harder drugs, many times guns. And this area of Gila Bend is one of the busiest in Arizona. It's the topography of this area that makes it so popular with smugglers. Look at what we're dealing with. There's a mountain range directly to the south of us. On either side of that mountain range are relatively flat areas where the smugglers move their drugs. There's a wash directly in front of us here, in fact, and it goes down underneath Interstate 8, and the smugglers oftentimes will end up right in that culvert just below our position. It's a good spot to control. The cartels, they like it too. Hot sauce bottle and these carpet shoes that the smugglers use to come up. I mean, you're not the only one who's using this, right? No, absolutely not. Uh, in fact, this is one of the observation points where we've actually taken off several of the drug smugglers' observation points. They'll put their own people up here, sometimes armed, sometimes they're not. We never know until we make contact with them. That's the real danger in this job. Those doing the watching are often watched themselves by some of the most ruthless criminals in the world. Get on the Still, with the success these deputies enjoy, taking drugs and guns out of the cartel's hands before they can hit the streets of the valley, it's a job they love and say the danger is worth it. Up here, I mean, it, it still gets exciting when we spot something and we start calling it out. It, it's an adrenaline rush and uh, I, I enjoy doing it. 10-4 copy.